I'm Dave Briscoe. I'm going to take you on a journey of having fun on the water. You're going to love it. So we'll start from the back. We've already uh, refurnished and refurbished the swim platform, the new teak. All the decals are off, all the grills are off, the whole interior is out. There's your 1988, boom. This is the boat that I started behind when I started at Cypress Gardens. We've got, uh, we had to replace the rings in the back. They were all rotted out on from the inside. We uh, painted the swim platform brackets. All decals, as I said, were off. We had to do some filling where there were some gouges in the boat. Rub rail is ordered. Uh, had to completely do the new strut. We put a uh, glide uh, pack housing on, which is the dripless pack housing. Had to redo the coupler as well. Motor's in good shape. All floor is out. All interior is being done right now. Dash came out yesterday. We're getting a new dash to match this. They'll have an all-new floor. Windshield is obviously off. We've painted that. Uh, that's ready to go back on pretty soon after the paint. And we had to do some filling on the front of the boat here as well. Uh, ordered new lights. This baby is going to be completely refurbished. But there's a good look at it. The top's going to be painted and the bottom is going to get a wrap. Going from black to an aqua blue. Uh, it's gonna match the truck. That's what it's gonna do. So there you go. All right, sports fans. It's the Mastercraft Pro Star 190. Still, we are changing the motor mounts today on the rear. And this is how you do it in Dave Briscoe's world. We got a nice little ratchet strap going around the. Back of the bell housing, front of the tranny, hooked up to a come along, hooked up to a chain, hooked up to the oak tree in the backyard. Ha <laughs> ha! Redneck engineering, baby. That's how you change the motor mounts in Briscoe's world. Hey everybody, Dave Briscoe back with the 88 Mastercraft project. Today we are cleaning up the bow. We had uh, bondoed, there was a big um, rub mark kind of dug out in the keel here so we uh, bondoed it in and now today I've got to sand it so I had to lift it off the trailer so we're back to the come along in the tree the old faithful oak tree we've come along the bow off the front of the trailer I'm now sanding a two and a half inch strip uh, cleanliness on each side so like from here I'll have to clean up that bondo and I've got a cover here so this baby is a stick-on keel protector, and I've already cut the front to match the bow, and we're gonna sand this, clean it up, and then put the keel protector on. Uh, tomorrow it goes for wrap, so tomorrow afternoon I'll do a video. Oh, I put a new horn in too. I was gonna do a horn on the top, but I was afraid a rope might catch on it, or if you take a bow wave, you know, it would wreck the horn. So I cut a hole in the side of the boat, and I did a hideaway horn, which they didn't have on this model, but. I think it's clean. It'll look good on the boat. So uh, there's your update. Stay in touch. Hey everybody, Dave from the Outside Edge. Here we are, the 88 Pro Star. We're at Visual Images with my buddy, Barry. And we're gonna come show you what's going on with the boat right now. So here we are, we're putting the wrap on. Barry's hard at work, only a couple goddammits at a time here. <laughs> I thought you were going to admit those. <laughs> <laughs> and she's coming together. So the bottom's going to be the gray to match the top deck. And then the blue stripe in between, the high metallic. And she's coming together. Talk to you soon.